Hello, I'm Robert Alderson and I teach singing at the uh, Dublin Conservatory of Music and Drama and I'm just about to start a lesson with David here, my pupil who is a second year undergraduate. So we're just going to deal with, with the stance and breathing to start off with. So David, you see how you've got your hands here like spades at the side? You need to get the thumb on the side on the trousers. Try and encourage the shoulders back into slightly a, a military sort of stance. Feel nice and important so that you look really good and imposing. That's fabulous. Now what I want you to do is to take the breath out, exhale the breath on a tss. So let that all go in and try and keep the breath even. I don't want any tss. Is that the best you can do? Oh no, okay. Right, what I want you to do again now is just take the breath out again. That's good. Out, get more out. Now just let the vacuum work and open the mouth and that's good so that this all comes out. Now and keep it even. Use the abdominals here to control the exhalation. Keep the hiss equal. And then when you come to the end, I don't want any movement here. I just need to see this fill up again. Good. That was good, but could you actually do it without the noise? I don't want to do this. I, you've got to make a silent intake of breath. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. So let's try that again, shoulders back. That's good now. That's good. Keep, keep the tone even. We don't want any wavering at all. Imagine you're singing your phrase, you're singing, singing, and then you want to breathe. Keep the space. Good, and off you go to sing again. Good, now that's, that's good. So just, just in your practice every day, make sure that this happens. It's, it's, it's very important that you keep in contact with your breathing apparatus. And you can actually extend this by doing chops here, can you do the same again and then can you do the exercise where you go tss, 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 to really strengthen these? That's good. Go on, carry on. Take, take, take the breath out again. Hands, hands. Good. That's very good. So these exercises just keep you in touch with your, your diaphragm and all the breathing uh, apparatus. Now, what I want to do now is to just carry on this. I have a little exercise which we use where they sing the months of the year. And it's, it's sort of, you can keep track of how good, you, good you're doing. So one week if you start, you may get January, February, March, April. And then the next month, the next week you may get to December, whatever. You're trying to get through the whole year in one breath. So can we try this? Mm -hmm. So there's an F, no, there's an E flat. So think of the way you breathe, just as though you've done the exercise. Shoulders back a bit more, good, and. January, February, March, April, May. So, hopefully in a few weeks, if he practices, he'll do two years, then three years, you, you, you just keep on going to extend the breath capacity, yeah? Let's just try that once more. I'll just take it to the F sharp. And, no, you didn't really breathe in your face. Sort yourself out. Good. And. No, I heard it. I don't want to hear that breath. I don't want to hear the breath go in. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March. So next week I'll expect you to 
get to July without it. Good. So that's the, the, the breathing. 